Everyone's been asking me to give a shot of my new Line 6 spider valve by uh, with the Bogner amplification, the tube amps. So there she is. This is my rack. I have a wireless. I have a 31 band EQ. I have a 4 band parametric EQ also. I have the BBE Sonic Maximizer and I have a hush I had picked up uh, to help quiet down that line 6 at times uh, with the high gain that it has. It has noise gain in it but it's just sometimes not enough with the heavy overdrive this amp has. So I'll give you a uh, tour of my presets here. I've got four presets that I had to work on. They they're close and stuff, but you have to uh, work them into your sound, everything. So. I'll give you a couple demonstrations of things, so. <laughs> Okay, there's that. That's my clean channel for when I play out. This is a little dirtier channel for my rhythm, so I'll just throw in some uh, something. And then I added a third channel with this that's a little m more volume to it, a little cleaner, uh, with more higher end, some highs added to it to help cut through the rhythms that you know, the guitar player is playing so I could add some octaves or something to cut through a little, like as in... You know, I'll play the two channels and switch so you can hear the difference. So that was that. And then uh, I also added on my on channel D for my lead when I get to play some. So um, I play a short little rhythm thing and then I'll just uh, play a few lead notes so you can hear the difference in uh, volume and tone. So here's the rhythm. I'm not going to elaborate on any lead riffs, I'm not a shredder or anything like that, it's just I want to give you a heads up, I've been asked uh, for some of the Line 6 things and wanting to show the amp, everyone was wanting to know about the, the HD100 head, so you know that's just a heads up on all that. So. <laughs> 